Hello guys, welcome back to some more of our Earthbound playthrough. Uh, we did some things in the off time, and not a whole lot, mostly just selling a whole bunch of eggs to get ourselves a little bit more money. Not too much, I do believe we got ourselves up to about $4,000. Um, so, no killing, no leveling, anything like that, we were just doing a bunch of selling. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and get started here again. We did walk ourselves back through the cave and get us to the pencil here. And we're gonna go ahead and use the pencil eraser that we got from the apple kid. Alright, for some weird reason, the iron pencil statue was erased. Hmm. Nice invention. Okay. So now we're gonna walk through here and hope that we do not die along the way. We should probably be running into a lot of sprouts and a lot of the uh, UFOs. And hopefully one of the teddy bears survives the trip. If not, oh well. So we do have two teddy bears, and this one has actually taken a little bit of damage. Um, we weren't trying to level, but we did run into, um, yeah, we did run into a UFO on our way to the pencil. So the first teddy bear did get some damage taken to him. All right, so the second teddy bear might not survive. More than likely, the teddy bear will not survive. Well, we got damage instead of the teddy bear. Right, and we're probably actually going to get a level here very shortly. Forgot the uh, these guys sprout themselves and bring on more of them. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. We should be able to heal up somewhere in the village that we're going to and get our HP and everything back. Okay, yep, we did get that level. don't have any room for anything actually. Oh, I do. Oh, that's right, because the teddy bear is gone. Okay. And we need to go. Oh, there's a bunch of them now. Well, not a bunch, but... <laughs> okay. Oh, I forgot that the trees are enemies too. Oh no, I turned and he he gets the first hit. No. Alright, that stuffiness beam that he just did, um, that causes you to have a cold. And that will actually... Aw, oh, bye bye teddy bear. The cold will actually have you lose health. So you sneeze and lose health. No. No. Okay, that 
that's good. Gonna eat a burger here. Things there. I don't want to fight too many things at once. Uh oh, okay, I can't go far enough to get that one to go away. I guess I'm stuck with the sprout. so many it just like lagged the game. <laughs> come on. Oh come on, go away. I mean I know we want to fight stuff to get some more money and we need the uh, the experience for the levels. But I don't want to fight too many things at once. Okay, we're gonna fight the tree. <laughs> A happy little tree. You're so happy. I'm missing with that slingshot. I should have stuck with the bat. Guy. So I guess that was a nice way to come. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. I guess it wasn't a total waste because we got to have a picture. Of all the times I have played this game, I mean, I've actually... This is, this is one of the few games that I have completed multiple times. Um, not like a whole bunch of times, but I've actually played the game 
all the way through more than once. Um, and I'm pretty sure I've still never found every single spot where you take pictures. I'm sure I've missed quite a few. Why would someone do this? Crud. Yeah. It's not nice to make the bridge impassable. I just go around like I did. Okay, there's another present up there. And there's also monsters up there. If I sound quieter than usual, guys, I'm sorry. I'm actually recording this um, past midnight, so I'm trying to be quiet for the other person around. seem a little strange or stranger than usual. It's also because I'm pretty tired. A couple of life noodles. I don't remember seeing those so early in the game. Sorry about all the, the squeakiness. I cannot get the, the squeak out of the chair. Okay. We're going to go into the little cave. Caves are fun. They were the those snakes because it didn't seem to be running away. And we have made it to the village. Welcome to Happy Happy Village. We're going to see all the happy happy people. <gasps> Excuse me, tourist. I'm collecting donations to help protect the world from contaminants. Donate whatever you can. No, I'll be your shadow then. That's right. She will follow me until I give stuff. One day, Mr. Carpenter received a revelation. He now speaks the real truth. Oh. Being attacked already. The insane cultist. Oh no, he's painting me. Why would you paint me? You want to talk to Mr. Carpenter directly? You must think you're pretty important, and boy, do you have a lot of nerve. You deserve to be struck by lightning. Well, aren't these people just happy, happy, lovely? I lost my shadow. Ha oh, ha, I lost my shadow. Oh, she's stuck on the tree. <laughs> Mr. Carpenter communicates with the divine, so he is able to deliver inspired messages. Oh, he's a blue cow. 
I'm just a pain old cow. But Mr. Carpenter's messages always move me. <laughs> farm. Lodging's available. Psst, 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 psst. That overweight kid helped me. We kidnapped Delph. You know, she's hidden in a mountain cabin. Oh, oh, now I've done it. I thought you were one of us. You know, I was joking. Ha 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 Just forget about this. Well, now that we have that little message, this might actually be a good time to uh, say see you guys next time, next episode. Uh, we will continue to explore Happy Happy Village, and then we will go ahead and uh, see if we can't find poor little Delph. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe if you are enjoying these videos. And even if you aren't, go ahead and comment. Just keep your comments polite. Even if you hate this stuff, just be polite. <laughs> Have a good one, everybody. See you next time.